Hey guys, welcome to another wonderful episode of probably one of the most depressing games I've ever played. Mm-hmm. Telltale's The Walking Dead. This is episode nine. Shit. Part nine of episode four of season one. It's a lot to keep track of. We're going to watch this tape, and it's going to give us all sorts of revelations and feels, I think. Maybe. Or it's it's nothing. Let's do it. Or are we just going to watch him come back to life as a zombie? Eh, probably. No. Nope. Oh, Listen, told as you. as it was, I have to put a stop to this little arrangement. This is the last I can give you. Why? Overson had someone down here yesterday taking inventory. He's really cracking down. I just hey, can't she's exchanging we sex for deal. drugs. Yeah, mm-hmm. That's great. We had a deal. We don't anymore. My sister needs this medicine. Without it, she'll Aww. die or she'll start showing symptoms I told you and take it was her, her sister. I can't let that happen. I'm sorry, Molly. I've done all I can, but I have to look out for myself here. Yeah, that's the Crawford way, isn't it? Ooh. Well, that, I told you it was going to explain junk. Yep. Well, shit. I mean, that's pretty much the correct reaction, Lee. All right, time for shit to hit the fan, because we've got all the stuff we need. Oh, definitely. So, things are going to end poorly. And even if they don't, when we get back, we have to decide who can go on the boat and who can't. No. I vote against Kenny. Definitely. And kind of against Ben. Those two can. Hey, Jesus those two Christ. can there chill together. Is. They're bros. The fuck you gave you us a fright. Sightseeing. I'll take that battery down. Oh, yeah. Uh, about that. What? I'm just kidding. You suck. She have blood on her face. Yeah, I think she did last there time we go. saw her too, though. Your sense of humor leaves a little to be desired. <laughs> What's that? Got a got Nothing. a little something on you. It's a picture of her sister. What? What? Quickly! I know you you're from Crawford. Act, Molly. Okay. I know you're from Crawford. What? Who told you that? I saw you on a security tape. Why'd you lie to me? I said there were stories about Crawford. I never said that's how I knew about it. I never lied to you, and even if I See, did, so what? I don't owe you anything. You saved my life twice, but it's you good can't I didn't tell me accuse her of lying. Are we really gonna mm-hmm. do this now? more gentle. I guess that's up to you. I used to live here with my sister. She was 14 years old. When the dead started walking and Crawford shut itself in, it seemed like a pretty good deal at first. We were safe. We had everything we needed to survive. And then, then the things hit the fan. It hit the no fan. No one who couldn't justify their place, earn their keep. No one who required who special care. No one. My sister was diabetic. This game. And by Crawford's yeah. rules, that made her a liability. I kept it a secret. Kept her safe. Oh, as long as I so could. her sister was but not the pregnant end, woman. Okay. Especially because her sister her. was 14 years That's old. Yeah, out. that that part Crawford, weirded me out a little they bit. Always talked about because how that system worked. woman did how not look 14 was years old. She did not. One of them. But I saw what they'd already become. I just wish I could have seen it before it was too late. Before they came and took my sister away. See, I have no problems this with you. This is all I have left yep. of her. I didn't have time I to understand. take it before I got out of Crawford. I understand. I just wanted it, okay? It's okay, Molly. I understand. She's pretty. What the hell? Oh shit! Cute to get the hell out of here. Someone's ringing that bell, and they pulled away all the zombies that were at the the door there. Mm-hmm. Oh, oh, hey, hey ben. there. Sorry. Oh, I no. Spooked by those bells. And Wasn't that the axe that was in the door? What the fuck are you doing out here? Yeah, but the door's gone. The, the, the door zombies are gone. Family. He I sent think. me out to look for something we can use to bust it open. I found this. Uh, Ben? Where did you get that? I just found it. It was stuck in the door handle at the end of the hallway. God damn it, Ben. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, shit! Oh, 
Damn. That's why we keep we want to keep her around and not right? dead. She's a badass. Shoot the trucker! I missed. Thanks. Uh, I thought I missed. It wasn't me. Oh yeah, see? Nice hey, Clem! Good thing I we brought her. What the fuck is going on? They're coming. Oh shit. That ought to hold them. Sir, but now how do we get out? Through the armory. We can just get this damn door open. <laughs> Why do I? Come on, damn Look at Ben. He knows he's a fuck up. Just <laughs> every time with that kid. Uh. This is my fault. All my fault. What the hell's he babbling about? Ben, we talked about this. No, wait. I want to know what he meant. What do you mean? It's this all is gonna all come fault. pouring out. Ben, he Jesus. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, man. Kid, this ain't you know the best what? time. What do you think? Whatever you did, save it for later. I don't know what the right answer Hurry. is for this. I said Hurry. Silence Hurry. After we get out of here, it's been me all along. Oh, I did all silence. Of us in danger. Katja and Duck. It was all me. It was all me. This is the absolute worst time for this. Wait a minute. What are you saying? It was me who made the deal with the bandits at the Motor Inn, slipping them supplies. I thought maybe I could keep them off our backs. When it got discovered, that's when they attacked. And that's when Duck... Oh, Lord. Uh, oh, boy. Kick his ass Kid later. Man, I agree with you. You should kick his ass. But now's not the time. Gotta focus on getting out of here. You little pisshead! You're fucking dead, you hear me? Dad! My wife and child! You gotta both fucking kill! Kenny! Listen to well, me. that bromance you can is over. Last later. <laughs> right now, we gotta go. It was just starting to blossom. Nice group I know. Here. Not the time, Molly. If this asshole thinks he's getting on my boat after what he did, he's out of his motherfucking mind. Kenny, we'll sort this out later. After we get out of here, okay? Ain't nothing to sort out. I just told you the way it's gonna be. The boat's okay. not big enough for uh. all of us. Somebody's gotta get left behind. Might as well be this piece of shit right here. Well, I vote we leave him. I'm sorry, Ben. I know you mean well, but all I want to do is get back to Omi. We don't have to leave him here is. now. Wait, yeah. don't I get a vote? Of course you do. Of course do. you do. Ben's nice. He's my friend. Oh, God we damn don't it. We leave friends Aww. behind. That's my vote. On second thought, I think I'm going to abstain. Lee? <sighs> I abstain? <laughs> Uh, I've seen us. enough yeah. of Crawford to know that becoming like them is the beginning of the end. I vote Ben stays with us. Yay, Clementine approves. What about the rest of us? Don't we get a say? Well, not you. You don't. Oh, <laughs> oh wow. Hang back, now Vernon. Go? Hang back. Damn right. Vernon, come on. Well, that makes one decision a little easier. What are you even so trying much for to the do? Armory. What's left of it? A few rounds. That's it. It's better than nothing. You didn't close that door behind us? I could. The lock was busted. Great. Just fucking great. Come on. There's got to be a way out down here. Woo! Hey! Not that way. Fuck! It's not gonna hold. Back upstairs! This is not going well. Ooh, a shotgun. Hey, look! Think it's got any ammo? I suppose we'll find out. Oh good, it doesn't make me aim. Yes! this well I kind of I'm kind of waiting because I you know I don't want to god damn it uh, full leg full leg and this is where we die again full leg yep you were right hey my guts oh hey nice to see you guys I always wanted to see what we look like on the inside yeah I was trying to look up the free walkers or play walkers but full leg look up Die! 
Pull leg. Pull leg. Nope. All right, note to self. Keep got, looking up. Gotta, gotta do some management here. All right, so pull leg twice. I would twice. say pull leg, yeah, twice, leg. and then look up. Look up. And then pull the leg once. Pull leg. Look up. Shoot. Nope. You, you, uh, your timing was off, I think. In what? Was, well, thanks, there Megan. There was some, there was some delay in, in looking back down to pull your pull leg. leg. Pull leg. <laughs> shoot. shoot. Or just wait and shoot. Look down. Wait. Pull leg. Because I have to wait for him to cock the gun again. Great. I'm glad that no one's decided to help me. Oh, there we go. by that second door. Okay. That also was shut. Oh, you should oh. be dead, sir. Boop. Too bad I lost the hatchet. Come on! But we live to see another day. Not, not, a, not a time for hugging. I appreciate it, anyway, out of here. let's go. This leads to the roof. We might be able to find a way down from there. You didn't come into town from the railroad, did you? Yeah. Why? Never mind. I can see the sewer where we came in from here. I think Damn it, Vernon. Do don't clip under well, me are we like that. For? Go, go! <laughs> What's going on with the railroad? Come on, let's go! Uh... tried so hard to keep you safe and save your life and you're a dick and you suck. Climb up! Come on, you can do it! There's no time! You have to go! Now! Fucking around, Don't be man. a martyr, you Come on! Douche. Let go, damn it! Get Clem and the others out of here! Lee! <laughs> <laughs> what kind of look is that? Just like a quit wasting time, douchebag. No. Let me go. Uh, nope. Son of a bitch. You don't get to die. <laughs> you die on our terms. Go, go, go. Woo. All right. Give me odds on Omid being alive. Uh, I don't know. Krista? Everything okay? Omid! Maybe he's just asleep. Yeah, seriously. Clem, stay back. Don't get any closer. I never should have left you. I'm so sorry. Krista, get away from him. Nope, he's okay. Uh, <laughs> hey. Back already? We got you medicine. Good. Feel like I could use some. Mmm, dry swallowing. Blech. Yum. You okay, kid? You look worse than I do. Yeah, We almost well. didn't make it out of there because of this asshole. Should have left him behind when we had the chance. Oh, at least we've got angry Kenny back. Guys, yep. What the hell happened is is out that there? better than despondent Let Kenny? Let someone else tell you. I got work to do. Okay. With Kenny's a just going to leave us high and dry. Oh my so. god, that would be the worst. I'll stay here for a few more hours to check on him. Let me know if you need anything. Thanks, Doc. Yes. Why does Thank you so he much. not have a pillow? Is that supposed to be a uh, pillow? Maybe it looks like a so. bad for you and me to have a little talk in private. 
This episode's going a little long, but I feel like this is this part's going long, but I feel like the episode's gonna end soon. We're not gonna I'm apologize for Bree? Done for us. Save your platitudes for someone who's buying it. Oh shit. What? You don't think by now I got you figured? You don't strike me as someone who has a lot of consideration what? for others. Where's this coming Look from? What you did to get me to come here with you in the first place. You expect me to believe you give a shit that it wound up costing Bree her life? Now just hold on a damn minute. Listen. Oh, no, you listen. You got some good people here, and they look to you as their leader. Well, I'm here to tell you the kind of leader you are. They're not gonna make it much longer. Holy shit! You're kidding yourself if you think putting them all on a boat is gonna solve anything. Now you may not care about all of those people, but I know you care about that little girl, which is why I'm gonna make you an offer. What kind of an offer? That was cold. Yeah, it was. I'll take her off your hands. Take her back with me to my people. We're well supplied, well hidden, and a lot of us have had kids of our own. And now Crawford's fallen, we got nothing left to fear from them. She'll be safe with us. Safer uh, than she will be if she stays with you. I promise. Walk away? That's what you want for her, isn't it? To be safe? I'm gonna pretend you didn't say any of this and give you a chance to walk away, which you ought to do right now. Well, I know you think you're doing what's best for her, and if you were her real father, we wouldn't be having this conversation. But you're not, are you? Just another one of your lies. Oh, that's right. We did tell him that. Yeah. Didn't we? Girls in my care. Whoops. We've been through more together than you can imagine. Anyone who tries to get between me and, and her, she's gonna be anyone, standing there. Isn't it's she? gonna wind up dead. You hear me? Take your hands off me. Vernon, don't take no guff. Nope. somewhere yeah I'm about to head out I, I just wanted to say thanks oh uh, she's everything. ditching too it's been mm -hmm. fun <laughs> you know what it's all it's all Kenny and Ben's fault it might be for the best it's gonna be crowded as it is you kind of strike me as more of a go it alone type yeah I've always had a hard time relying on other people Although I've got to admit, you've given me a reason to rethink that. Listen, I'm not much for goodbyes. Tell the others for me. Sure. You take care of yourself, Molly. You too, Leaf. Damn it. So Vernon's leaving. Molly's leaving. Bree's dead. Bree's dead. Ben so, is up shit's crick. Yeah, so that leaves with, with uh, hey, pretty much the old core group. Mm-hmm. Who all fucking hate each other. Kenny's working on the boat. I know. What are we going to do after he fixes it? Where will we go? Good question. Someplace else. <laughs> Someplace <laughs> else. Someplace better. Clem, honey, what's wrong? Is Ben going to be okay? He doesn't seem the same since he got back. He feels guilty. And he should, but I'm not going to say it's his I own fault. He's just feeling guilty about some of the decisions he's made. He's getting a feeling like he's a burden on the rest of us. And he is, but I'm not going to say that to you. Tomorrow, will we have time to look for my parents? Yes, lie. Oh, God. Uh. I'd like to, Clem, but I don't think we'll have time. We really shouldn't stay here any longer. It's not safe. What should Reach we out. do? Reach out. <laughs> it looks like he's gonna smack her upside the head. Oh, man. <laughs> you know what? We've been wafflers our entire playthrough. <laughs> and I think it's coming back to bite us in the ass. <laughs> been like, I don't want to take anyone's side. Ever. Now everyone hates us. <laughs> Uh, 
Walkie talkie's gone. <sighs> yep. Good so it's Clementine. Clementine? Oh, am I controlling? No. Uh, uh. Oh, good, it's just loading. Clementine? <laughs> Clementine! Everyone just left without Lee. This is what <laughs> happened. Oh, God. Hey. Do we have the walkie talkie still? Uh, I guess so. It looks like we have a note or something, too. Yeah. Oh, jeepers. Look at trash bins. I guess I shouldn't have looked at the trash bin. Probably not. Stop. Why was that even an option? Now there's blood on her hat. Aw, bummer. Oh, no. Oh, shit. No. 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 Fuck. Great. You out here? Oh no. Lee. Great. Our protagonist is Are infected. You crazy? What are you doing out here? Hide bite, hide bite. Safe. Lee? Really? Where's Clementine? Yeah, hide it. She's not in a room. Vernon ain't in the house either. What the hell is going on? Whose blood is that? It's a walker's. Fucker jumped me from behind. So where's Clementine? I don't know. Clementine's gone. I found her hat and her radio on the ground out here. That's all I found. I guess There's that no walker was going to happen no matter what, own? honestly. No, no way. Even if we went to pick up the walkie-talkie, would have blindsided us. Night Vernon came yeah. And offered to take her with him. Said she'd be better off. Son of a bitch. I knew we couldn't trust that fucker. Wherever she is, I have to find her. What? Well, what do you think? Hurry. Your call. Your call. Let's, on it. Let's be honest. Um, I'm bitten. Walker jumped me while I was out here looking for her. Oh my god. No way. No. No fucking way. I don't know how much time I've got. I'm gonna need your help to find her. Who's with me? <laughs> None of us! We're all responsible for Clementine. And in your condition, you may not make it to her in time. She needs our help. All of our help. Thanks, Chris. Damn right. We can't let you do this alone. I like you two. We'll and then there's Kenny. Together. Thanks, you guys. I appreciate it. Really. Lee, man, you know I care about Clementine. But. And I am a Christian man. And I keep asking myself if this was me asking you for help, asking you to put your life on the line, would you be there for me? Are you shitting me? You ain't been. Seriously? I I can't. Can we? Yes, please. You know do what, it. Kenny? Go fuck yourself. You gonna let a little girl die because I didn't have your back every damn minute? Maybe you should grow the fuck up. Do whatever you want, asshole. Oh, that's gratifying. You might not have been keeping score, Lee, but I sure as hell have. And you've been looking out for yourself more often than your friends. And then you lose your shit when they don't bend over backwards to help you? Well, fuck you. You're on your own now. I'll be damned if I'm gonna lift a finger. All right, peace. What about you, Ben? I don't know. Whatever you think is best. Clementine stood up for you. A few good things left in this world. That's she right. She stood up for you and Crawford when Kenny wanted you gone. Don't you think you owe it to her to stand up for her now? You're right. I owe her. It's not about Lee. It's I about swear, Clementine. Before this is all over, I'm gonna show you I can do something right. I'll prove it to you. You'll see. 
Uh, yeah, well, fuck Come you, on, Kenny. Guys, let's go. And everyone else, let's go. You want to bet Kenny takes the boat? I mean, whatever. I don't even care anymore. <laughs> I, okay, this episode's just gonna go super long, I guess. I really thought it was gonna end, like, a, a while ago. But I don't know how much longer it is, and I don't want to just have, like, a five-minute episode. Yeah. She's not gonna be here. Oh, They're good. gone. No one's here. They all left. It was all a dream. <laughs> You're not really bitten. Everything's fine. You're still in that cop car like from way back in the beginning home. of the game. Vernon, get out here! There <laughs> doesn't have to be any trouble here. From the crash. All I yep. want is the girl. Give her back, and nobody needs to get hurt. Uh, uh, no, okay. I hear walkers, I think. I see walkers. <laughs> Where are they going? Oh, we're gonna be stuck in the morgue, aren't we? <gasps> oh shit. Are you all right? Where are you? Vernon, you son of a bitch! Holy... That's not Vernon. That's not his color text. Who is this? It's not Vernon, if that's what you're thinking. And you should really watch your tone. Clementine's fine. But if I were you, I'd choose my next words very carefully. Oh, great. Uh, all right, let's let's see what happened. Did you kill the boy in the attic? Yep, majority. We lied to Vernon. We were in the minority. We were. That's interesting. We brought Clementine. We we saved Ben. <laughs> wow, everyone, a lot, tons of people were honest about the bite. Yeah. Uh, all right, let's let's get our preview of the next episode. <sighs> Who came with you? Only fourteen percent. Wow. This is real broken, like real broken up. The majority is Jess Kenny. That's interesting. Huh. That's cool. I like that you might end up having. I wonder if we lied about the bite. If we would go solo. That's, yeah, maybe. Damn. Huh. Very interesting. Well, that was another episode. Yeah. Oh, it doesn't give us a preview or does it have to get past the credits? I don't know. I think it has to get past the credits. You have to get past the credits. Yeah. Well, this is a good time for me to say that I don't know if you've run into this problem. You probably have. But, like, for some reason this week, my garbage is just, like, extra stanky. Yes. And, like, I don't know what caused it. I, it's not like I, I didn't do anything differently. Can we also talk about the fact that, like, the one time there was a holiday and we're like... Nah, we don't need to put out trash tonight because anytime there's a holiday, trash never goes out on this night, but it's we always, always put it out day. anyway. And we didn't put our trash out this week, and they took the trash. So and you now, had a lot of guests on Saturday. <laughs> yeah, so so now I'm just stuck with a pile of trash and no room in, in my garbage cans. Ugh. 
Yeah. Yeah, my garbage is like super stinky and I'm just like, I, I can't even put it out because I don't have a dumpster. I just have to wait till they just pick up the bag. Oh, you can't get like a trash can for the outside? Uh, I guess I could, but those are expensive. <laughs> and I'm <laughs> super duper poor right now. Well, maybe Santa will get you a trash can for Christmas. Maybe. Special appearance by Bree. She's dead now. Oh. So I guess Molly was going to leave no matter what. Yeah. Because there was no option to have her with you. No. And I guess Verdon was going to peace Snarfles? out no matter what. Those are the pets. Snarfles. Peekaboo the cat. I saw Brennan Q. Ferguson. <laughs> <laughs> so. Yes. Uh, Yeah. All right. Give me that preview. Watch. We don't get one. We don't get one. We don't All right. get one. Sorry, guys. <laughs> that was... uh. Episode 4. There is one left of this season, guys. Mm -hmm. There's an extra downloadable one called 400 Days, but as far as I know, that doesn't focus on any of the people that were in this one. Yeah, I'm not really sure. I don't know. I mean, we're still going to play it. Oh, yeah. But we're, we're almost done, and it's been an emotional ride, and we're going to keep going. It's been something. It's been something. I just hope I'm not super bummed out by the ending of this. I'm just glad we got to tell Kenny to go fuck himself. That was very gratifying. Like, I, I'm going to play through this again, you know, privately afterwards and do some yeah. things differently. And Me like, too. I'm just going to be a complete dick to Kenny the entire time, I think. Instead it's warranted. Of, instead of, like, waffling about like we were this time, I'm just going to be like, hey, fuck you, dude. <laughs> you suck. But just be, like, one way or the other. Yeah. And then I guess I would go through and be, like, super nice to him and be like, we're bros. Bros till the end. <laughs> but I don't know if I could tolerate that. Best bros forever. Anyways, uh, thank you for watching. And we're going to move on to episode five. Mm -hmm. And see what happens.